welcome to TPC Valencia, site of the 2008 Newhall Cup for Boys Golf. I'm Dave Caldwell, and while technically this is a two-round tournament sponsored by the Newhall Land and Farming Company, it is also the final two league matches of the Foothill League Boys Golf 2008 season, so only those players from the six Santa Clarita public schools can participate. Round one of the two-day Newhall Cup saw Hart's Johnny MacArthur fire a three under 69 and a three-shot lead over Valencia's Max Homa. One stroke behind Homa at one over par was West Ranch's Colin Wheeler. His Wildcat teammate Ryan Weltig and Hart's Tanner Diaz were tied for fourth with opening day 77s. Two Wildcats in the top five after day one of the Newhall Cup is indicative of what West Ranch has been doing in 2008. In just their second year of varsity golf, the West Ranch Wildcats find themselves undefeated in the Foothill League and in first place. And they are doing it with a relatively young team. Um, this is a breakout year for us. Um, we always knew that we had players coming that could, could play the game. For us this year, it's, it's been a, a, a joy, a joy to watch them actually fulfill their dreams of playing high school golf, whether it be my freshmen or whether it be my seniors. Um, from the very beginning, we've kind of been slated as a team to beat this year, um, knowing what players are coming in. And I'm happy for my team, the, the freshmen down to, or freshmen up to the seniors, that I say, hey, we're going to play that level and we're going to show you, yes, we are the team to beat. Freshman J.J. Holen has been the number one player for the Wildcats. Yes, he's the coach's son, but scoring is what moves a golfer to the top of his team. And even par 72 at Valencia Country Club earned him medalist honors early in the league season. Um, freshman coming in. For me, I um, saw him grow up playing golf, never really knowing what he could do when it came time for tournament. Um, when it came time for tournament play, he definitely stepped up and said, hey, I can play this game and I want to play this game. Um, consistently in the 70s, has gone low sometimes in some of our ranking and some of our preseason matches, um, but has done a great job starting our team off well in all of our league play. Senior Ryan Weltig has battled with Holen for the Wildcats top spot all season long. He's a guy that, that has, has a carefree attitude out here, just enjoys being out here and playing. And for him, he has done the same thing. Mid-70s, for most of part, throughout the year in league play, um, has, has done a good job being the senior and kind of trying to take that leadership role of, hey, let's get together and play. Yet another freshman is one of West Ranch's top players. Jay Lim was co-medalist in the first league match of the season, played at Robinson Ranch. To me, a surprise. Didn't really know much about him, just heard about him coming in. Um, has come out, doesn't hit the ball long, but. Um, he's been, he classified, hey, we're going to have a Jay Lim round, and what that means is, hey, I'm just going to hit par, maybe a birdie here, maybe a bogey there, but pretty much a par round for him. Um, between the three of them, JJ, Ryan, and, and Jay, they're all in that mid-70 round for us. With quality young players, the future certainly looks bright for West Ranch Boys Golf. The future definitely looks bright because we only have one senior playing for us, and with hopes of some other players coming back for us next year, um, next year looks to be good for us again. Picking up the action on day two of the Newhall Cup, we have Valencia's Max Homa putting for Eagle on 17. Yes, he's got it. Homa moves to two under on the day. Homa's Vikings once again find themselves challenging for the league championship. Valencia's boys golf coach Rusty Swisher has taken his Vikings to the postseason in each of the last 13 years. The Vikings were league champions in 2000 and then again in 2002, but since then have been league runner-up five years in a row. Once again in 2008, the Vikings find themselves in second place. This year um, has been very interesting. Uh, we've had you know, uh, you know, six guys, seven guys, eight guys that filter in for our, you know, for the six that we tee up. And we just can't seem to arrive on the same day with the same low score. We'll always have a low score or two, but it takes uh, all, all six guys to really drop it down, break 80 every time. Max Homa is the Vikings' number one player, just a junior Homa showed brilliance a year ago as one of the league's top players and has continued his good play into 2008. Uh, he's a fabulous player, a tenacious competitor. He's into uh, winning, and that's what this game is all about. Great focus, uh, 
great student. Junior Alex Macaluso is Swisher's number two player. A carefree, fun-loving attitude on and off the green. Macaluso knows how to score when he needs to. Competitor, real good putter. Ball striking. Yeah, yeah, ball striking, both he and Max. Uh, they expect to shoot par better. It's one of my little funky acronyms, POB, P-O-B. Par better, the, you know, the ultimate goal in golf. Lefty Kevin Fitzgerald, another junior, comes in as Valencia's number three player. He's known on the Vikings squad as Butter. Because he's just got a real smooth swing. He's still developing his game. My program over the years is, has always been a developmental program. We just develop and get, try to get better uh, every week. You know, we, we, every week we give it full effort. Nobody ever gives up. You know, I never hear about that. Back to the action where West Ranch's Colin Wheeler needs this for par. He uses all of the cup for that one. Wheeler stays in the hunt in third place at the 2008 New Hall Cup. We've got more final round action right after this. Log on now to ProSportsCollector.com for the very best in sports collectibles with an accent on vintage memorabilia. All items are competitively priced and guaranteed. ProSportsCollector.com only sells authentic memorabilia from contracted signings, only through reputable companies and always includes an original certificate of authenticity. ProSportsCollector.com merchandise makes the perfect gift for any occasion, corporate events, and of course, your own personal collection. Choose your favorite today. ProSportsCollector.com. Howdy friends, it's time to dust off your boots and head on over to the city of Santa Clarita's annual Cowboy Festival. The Old West comes alive. As you walk down the streets of the Manager Ranch Motion Picture Studio, they've been on stop entertainment all weekend with nationally renowned musicians and cowboy poets. Get fitted up with authentic cowboy gear and taste the best cowboy grub in the West. So come on out to the historic Manager Ranch Motion Picture Studio in the rustic hills of Santa Clarita. Hi, I'm Ed Cox with Carpet Clearance. You know us. We're the go-to people for your flooring needs with carpet, vinyl, tile, hardwood, and laminate flooring. We're the only flooring center in the valley with quality room-sized remnants at savings of 50% or more. You can buy cash and carry, or if you prefer, we'll install your new flooring with our lifetime installation warranty. We do flooring right, and we're right here in the heart of Santa Clarita. Carpet Clearance on Golden Triangle Road next to Consumer Furniture. Baking what you love makes everyone happy. Visit bakingwhatyoulove.com and discover all the tools and resources to feed your favorite hobby. We offer quality products at competitive prices for the curious beginner to the expert baker. Enter discount code SCVTV at checkout and save an extra 15%. If you love baking cookies with your grandchildren, baking artisan breads, or creatively decorating cakes, bakingwhatyoulove.com can help you. Visit us today. As Miss Valencia, I need a great smile. Baywood Dental Group makes that easy. Everyone here is so nice, and it's all high tech, which is pretty cool to know you're on the cutting edge of treatment and comfort. Baywood provides general and cosmetic dentistry for your whole family, and there's a variety of outstanding dentists to choose from. For a limited time, whiten your teeth with the Zoom Whitening System for only $275. That's $175 savings. Call Baywood Dental in Valencia today and smile. Welcome back to SCV TV's coverage of the final round of the Newhall Cup from TPC Valencia. In yesterday's first round, Hart's Tanner Diaz sank this 15-footer for birdie en route to a 77 to help the Indians. In third place going into today's final round, the Indians as a team have had a tremendous legacy of boys golfing talent, and 2008 is no exception. I didn't expect us to, um, I knew what West Ranch had, they had some young phenoms, and just like uh, Hart girls, had this year, they have some young players that are just, they're, they're going to score well consistently. I knew that uh, Hart and Valencia was going to battle out for second place, and uh, it's still up for grads as far as I'm concerned, second place. But uh, we're lucky to be fortunate in the Foothill League, three teams go to CIF. So we're in a transition. Last year, the JV team won league, and now all those guys on that JV team are now on the varsity, so now they're trying to get some varsity experience, and the only one that has the varsity experience is Johnny. MacArthur. MacArthur is the odds-on favorite to bring MVP honors back to the Newhall campus. A three-sport athlete, MacArthur was all-league in football and soccer, 
but it's golf that has provided a scholarship to Pepperdine in the fall. He is a competitor, and we know that because uh, of his one season in football. Um, he's a competitor. He will not give up. He will keep fighting. And that's what we're trying to have him be an example to some of these younger golfers. Tanner Diaz has consistently been shooting mid-70s all season as the Indians' number two player. Tanner is, um, he is a guy that struggles off the tee box but from uh, the middle fair, from the middle irons in, he is a battle. So he is what I would call a grinder, a grinder. He will grind out the game and um, get the best score possible. When he gets more consistent off the tee box, he'll be a negative. The Indians will lose two players to graduation, which means four players getting experience this year on varsity will be back in 2009. And it all depends what the younger guys coming up can do. But uh, these four guys that are on the varsity now that will compete next year um, they're going to do just fine next year with a lot of experience. Back to the action as we go to the second hole where Songus' Tim Bellinger has this 35-footer for birdie. Beautiful. Nothing but the bottom of the cup. As we play what is also the final league match of the season, the Songus Centurions find themselves just on the outside looking into the top three teams in league that will advance to the CIF Team Regionals. Losing the league MVP from last season, Nick Delio, and another top 10 finisher, Justin Renault, has set the Centurions back a bit in 2008. You're dropping a, a 68 and a 70 makes it a little bit tougher for us. Um, and then we actually lost another kid who moved who was a freshman last year, so we lost our number uh, two. Or actually, it would be our number three we lost. So you lose your top three golfers, makes it a little difficult. So we've struggled a little bit this year, especially in a league that's pretty good. We've progressively gotten a little bit better each time and, and doing what we can do. The Centurion's top three golfers are virtually interchangeable as they find themselves ranked 9th, 11th, and 13th in league coming into today's final match. Straddling's number one today, junior Justin Hancock. He's not particularly, doesn't hit the ball particularly far, although he's a lot further now uh, than he was last year. He's gained a little bit of strength there. Um, but he hits it fairly straight and he keeps the ball in play. You don't see a lot of big scores from him. You're not going to see a round where he has six birdies either. You know, he usually will have a couple birdies and he'll have some bogeys and, and kind of balance it out. But you won't see a, you know, a lot of triples or quads from him. That's just not, he's just consistent. It's going to be usually par or bogey, par or bogey, and he's kind of work his way through. Freshman Andrew Moore is listed as Saugus's number two. A basketball player, Moore is just now getting his golf legs down. He hits the ball very solid. Um, I think his, his strength is that he doesn't know any better. <laughs> his weakness is that he doesn't know any better. You know, it's, it's a double-edged sword there. Um, he, when he goes out and will just play and not try to overthink things, he's a very good golfer. Uh, sometimes he tries to overthink things and, well, I got to do this, or he tries to be too exacting. Um, and that will cause you problems in this game. I mean, if, if you'll just go out and swing the club and not worry about things, he does very well. Senior Daniel Straddling is number three. The Straddling family goes from dad the coach through Daniel and includes his twin sisters who play on the Centurions girls team. Consistency is always his thing. He hits the ball a mile. <laughs> um, and last year he was very up and down in scores from week to week. I think he went 92-77 uh, in back-to-back -back matches in the league. Uh, this year, his scores are pretty close to where they are. I think his low in league is 78, and his high in league, I think, is like 84. So they're fairly close together. His difference is usually it's a front nine versus a back nine. Um, last league match, he went 45-37. Uh, uh, Depth, however, has been a problem for Saugus this year and maybe next year. We're, we don't have a lot of people in our program this year. We, we only were carrying uh, 14 total players, which is pretty light when you're playing it. Today, we put, have six playing varsity and six playing JV. There's only two sitting home. Um, and so it's, we're, we're a little bit shy this year as far as numbers, but we've got a real good bunch of kids. A lot of fun with these kids. They get along real well. They talk to each other real well. Um, they kick each other in the pants when they need to be. They pick each other up when they need to be picked up. And, and it's kind of, fun to have that kind of group. Back on 15 where Max Homa needs this for birdie.
Valencia's Max Homa continues to put pressure on MacArthur. Will MacArthur's lead hold up? The 2008 Boys Newhall Cup from TPC Valencia will return right after this. As Miss Valencia, I need a great smile. Baywood Dental Group makes that easy. Everyone here is so nice and it's all high tech, which is pretty cool to know you're on the cutting edge of treatment and comfort. Baywood provides general and cosmetic dentistry for your whole family and there's a variety of outstanding dentists to choose from. For a limited time, whiten your teeth with the Zoom Whitening System for only $275. That's $175 savings. Call Baywood Dental in Valencia today and smile! Baking what you love makes everyone happy. Visit bakingwhatyoulove.com and discover all the tools and resources to feed your favorite hobby. We offer quality products at competitive prices for the curious beginner to the expert baker. Enter discount code SCVTV at checkout and save an extra 15%. If you love baking cookies with your grandchildren, baking artisan breads, or creatively decorating cakes, bakingwhatyoulove.com can help you. Visit us today. Are you ready for this? Fast go-karts, splashing bumper boats, exciting miniature golf, win some great prizes, try our new rock climbing wall, new arcade and games, our new Pharaoh's ice cream parlor, and our new laser tag arena. So come to Mountasia and see what's new. Mention SCBTV and get a buy one, get one free attraction. How you buy a car today has really changed. People used to kick tires and pick up brochures. Now it all starts on the web. Acura shoppers do their research online and know as much about these cars as we do. That's why Valencia Acura has a dedicated internet sales department with a great website where you can shop, compare, and even schedule a test drive. It's what we call auto buying comfort. It starts at ValenciaAcura.com. And it ends right here at Valencia Acura. It's a friendship. Cozy here. When it comes to heating and air conditioning, indoor air quality, and energy savings, Comfort Control is the pack leader. Schedule our preseason tune-up special today for only $79 to ensure your system's safety and efficiency. We're an authorized dealer for Bryant Heating and Cooling Systems. Bryant is well known for doing whatever it takes to make you cozy and happy. Comfort Control and Bryant understand comfort, both in your home and in your wallet, or my name isn't cozy. Welcome back to the 2008 Newhall Cup for Boys Golf from TPC Valencia. Robert Pyle on 18. He'll need that for par. The Grizzlies have shown vast improvement as a team here in 2008. We started the season off <clears throat> With, with high expectations for me. Now, high expectations for us is finishing in the middle of the Foothill League. We've shot, compared to last year, every one of our league matches except one, we've shot 50 strokes better, between 40 and 50 strokes better. So I look at that as improvement. Now, if you look at the standings, we're in fifth place. But I look at the numbers and say, our kids have done a magnificent job this year. And, and the improvement that I've seen from last year to this year, is, is fantastic. I'm very proud of the, the improvement and the strides that they've made. The state of the program, depth, don't have depth. I look at some of these other programs, you look out here, they got 20, 25, 30 kids. I've got 12. Robert Pyle is Golden Valley's number one golfer. A senior who has played in the program for four years, Pyle wants more than just a high school golf career. He's a super kid. He's, he's got a good tempo swing. He's got you know, a, a, a good, solid high school golf game. Wants to play in college, is being recruited by Drexel University in Pennsylvania, and he's been accepted to Penn State. And Bob is the kind of guy that he's not gonna, he's not gonna outdrive you. He's gonna put the ball in the middle of the fairway, he's gonna put the ball up close to the green. And, and you know, he's, he's a super kid too. 4.4 GPA, near 2,000 on the SAT. Great family, great kid. You know, I'm, I'm sad to see him go. Junior Austin Wolotarski has battled elbow tendonitis all year. The injury has kept him out of all but one league match. Has struggled a little bit, but has bounced back very well in league, shooting in the mid 80s, and, and I'm happy with Austin. He's gonna be my only senior next year. Dylan Vensky transferred from Vasquez High School a year ago, and while he is only in his second year playing the game, he has picked it up quickly. And he and Sean Weiss right now is a sophomore. They're both, they're both right there, so. 
Dylan's struggling <clears throat> a little bit mentally sometimes, but you just calm him down. He's got a good swing, puts the ball out there, hits the ball a long way. But with golf, it, a lot of it is mental. And Sean Weiss is the same way. You know, can, no problem hitting the ball. <clears throat> it's a lot of the mental things. Had a problem here, what do I do? How do I recover? You know, how do I play this hole? It's the course management and stuff like that. We pick up the action on the par 3 ninth with Canyon's Paco Franco chipping up. Canyon coach Dave Harris has found 2008 to be a tough year for Cowboy Golf. I'm a little disappointed in what we did this year. Uh, I thought we did a little better than we, we have. Uh, I was hoping to have uh, a goal of 400 as a score, which is averaging 80. And we didn't have quite got there yet. But uh, hopefully we'll make some improvements. And we're, we don't have any seniors. So um, hopefully we'll get a little lot done in the offseason and uh, come back strong next year. Long hitting Justin Golden has found himself at the top of the Cowboys team much of the season even though it's his first year in the program. He's first year in the program, left-handed player, hits the ball a mile. Uh, when he learns to control the swing and, and uh, cage his fury, if you will, he's going to be a tremendous player. Paco Franco is another long hitter who, like all good golfers, will improve his scoring dramatically with a better short game. He hits the ball a long ways also. Uh, he's uh, shot some good rounds for us. His strength is a long ball. and. Um, he has to get work on a short game some, and uh, improve that a lot. Be okay. There are currently no seniors on the Cowboys squad, which means 2009 should see vast improvement for the team. I would hope they work with a pro. Uh, I can help some, but uh, they need to get with a pro and uh, work on their games that way and get some t detailed instruction, and uh, that'll help them a lot. If, we, if our players after number three, or number two or three, uh, improve some, and we need to bring our hunters down to 90s, and uh, if we do that, we're going to be Competitive. Now Ryan Weltig on 18, his third shot. Oh, it checked up beautifully. Great shot, Great shot. from Ryan Weltig of West Ranch. And now Max Homa, his third shot. Another beauty, and it hit Weltig's ball. Weltig will suffer a penalty. He did not mark the ball. Therefore, that will be a two-stroke penalty against West Ranch's Ryan Weltig. He'll tap in now for double bogey six here on the par four 18th. Not a good way to finish and certainly disappointed Ryan Weltig. And now Max Homa to tap in for par. He's got it. He's going to finish the back nine three under. Two under for the day, two under for the tournament. Valencia's Max Homa. Now Johnny MacArthur needs this par putt to finish at four under for the day. And he just leaves it to the high side, the left side. But still, Johnny MacArthur back-to-back -back 69s with that tap-in for a bogey. Not the way he wanted to finish it, but still back-to-back -back 69s here at TPC Valencia. And Johnny MacArthur, six under will be the 2008 Newhall Cup champion, Colin Wheeler, now for par. And he's got it. Third place, solidly his for Colin Wheeler from West Ranch. So the final results of the 2008 Newhall Cup shows Hart's Johnny MacArthur winning by four shots over Valencia's Max Homa. Colin Wheeler of West Ranch places third, followed by Alex Macaluso and J.J. Holen. The final team standings of Foothill League Boys Golf shows the West Ranch Wildcats not only going undefeated and winning their first league championship, but it is the first championship for any sport at any level for West Ranch. Despite finishing with the same record, Valencia takes second with Hart and third based on strokes over the season. Those three teams will represent the Foothill League in the CIF team competition. The final individual standings shows Johnny MacArthur claiming the top spot and thus league MVP honors. He's followed by Max Homa and then three West Ranch players, Weltig, Holen, and Lim, with Hart's Tanner Diaz rounding out the Foothill League's top six. Well, that's going to do it for SCV TV's coverage of the 2008 New Hall Cup here from TPC Valencia. Congratulations, of course, to Johnny MacArthur, the 2008 New Hall Cup champion and the MVP of the Foothill League. So for everyone here at SCV TV, I'm Dave Caldwell. Thanks for being here, everyone. And we will see you again next time.
Log on now to ProSportsCollector.com for the very best in sports collectibles with an accent on vintage memorabilia. All items are competitively priced and guaranteed. ProSportsCollector.com only sells authentic memorabilia from contracted signings, only through reputable companies and always includes an original certificate of authenticity. ProSportsCollector.com merchandise makes the perfect gift for any occasion, corporate events, and of course, your own personal collection. Choose your favorite today. ProSportsCollector.com breathtaking and serene surroundings. Over 30 miles of pedestrian friendly paseos, exciting gathering places, protected natural areas, award-winning schools, abundant employment opportunities, homes of exceptional quality and character. It all comes together in Valencia. Looking for a car, truck, or van? Tune into the Power Hour Monday through Friday from 7 to 8 p.m. and Saturday and Sunday from 10 to 11 a.m. on Channel 6. Get great deals such as a 2007 Aveo for only $157 a month. Drive away in a Silverado Crew Cab for only $199 a month. Or get a 2007 Tahoe for only $299 a month. These and many other great offers you will only find on Power Chevrolet Valencia's TV Auto Mall on Channel 6. Tune in or you will miss out. Got me spellbound, baby. Can't get my mind off you. you got me spellbound, baby. Wow. Tell me the world's most perfectly cut diamond thrills like no other. Hearts on fire. At Classic Designs in Valencia.